is the Blink S. It's one of the newest models that Acton came up with. Zoom in, bro. I just got it a couple of days ago and it is much better looking in person. The quality on this thing is amazing. The wood, the grain, it's really beautiful. They definitely stepped it up from the last models. And I have two of them. If you uh, watch this, this review I did, you'll know what I mean. And I also did a video on versus the boosted board. This thing go for about $6.99, but you can use referral codes to lower the price a little bit. The quality of this board, you can't even compare it to the old Blink board. Of the battery casing is aluminum. The design is perfect the wheels are the same the components inside they said that they upgraded everything better wiring just better built overall they have a rear lights and a front headlights awesome thing about it is you can turn off the headlights from the app phone so that's really neat the grip tape on this is actually a spray-on can you see that it's actually a spray-on on this guy because you get to see the wood grain and the design of the actual board perfect place logo perfectly placed blink symbol right here very nice finish this board was well thought of and to be honest um, i really like this design much better than the s2 that's just my opinion um the old uh, blink board went 15 miles an hour this goes 15 miles an hour as well um the incline on the hill is also 15 percent and we'll test this out in a in a few minutes this one actually can go up to seven miles says it on the box too one thing i noticed is this part right here you see how that's flat the old blink board actually has the same indentation and there's a slight hump in the middle then it dents in again this one is actually flat and smooth carve out to me that's a big deal because when i used to ride the blink boards i could feel that hump i mean that doesn't bother me i just know i could i just this one it feels nice it feels like my foot is flush with the actual board the charger it's a little bit smaller i think i was told that the charger charges a lot faster than the older one remote is the same i actually customized my remote i made it gray it's pretty cool huh so it matches the reason why I customize my remotes is I have all these boards and I need to know which remote goes to what. And I also did a uh, video on that, on how to customize your remotes. Check it out right there. The other big difference too, that Acton fixed, it's not abrupt anymore. No abrupt takeoffs, no abrupt brakes. It's actually really smooth. For me, I mean, I got used to the blink board already. So those abrupt stops, abrupt brakes I got used to it um, so I didn't mind that's good for you beginners because I think that's gonna encourage you a little more to ride more Acton was actually listening Acton good job uh, the old blink board was actually 840 watts um, motor this one actually went down to 600 or 650 watts instead awesome get one of these guys it's worth the price and again the reason why i like Acton is because they have different size boards and they fit my budget this thing is only 27 inches long it's easy to carry it's light it's like i think 12 pounds or 10 pounds i like things that i could pack easy grab and go um, without any hassle so let's go take it for a ride yes cool
One thing though, I do miss the abrupt break. Let me tell you why. It's it's because making the board stop when I want it to. It's it's still great. It's still a great board. I'll link a referral code below if you want to get one of these boards. Whether you want to get the Blink S, S2, or the Quattro, you can get 5% off and pretty much um, get a pretty good deal. And also, if, if you subscribe to their news feed. Um, you can also get another $50 off. So that's it, I'm losing light. So I gotta get home, um, edit this video. Let me know if you guys have any questions. Thanks for watching.